Tesla Semi is entering a new era with mass production and incredible advancements. From a vehicle once doubted for its competitiveness, it has become the most powerful electric truck, capable of traveling 500 miles on a single charge, accelerating faster than diesel trucks, and offering outstanding operational cost savings. But what's truly shocking is that Tesla is ramping up production speed to the point where assembling a Semi takes only 10 minutes, or even just 5 minutes. The new factory aims not only to roll out tens of thousands of units, but is also rumored to have the capability to produce the robo-van. Beyond that, Tesla Semi continues to undergo rigorous testing, especially after an unfortunate accident to ensure it remains the top choice in the trucking industry. Since its launch, Elon Musk has repeatedly emphasized the benefits for those who own a Tesla Semi, benefits that will become even more apparent as large-scale production hits the market. So, what makes the Semi the most valuable truck to revolutionize the transportation industry? Let's dive into all the latest updates on the Semi and uncover the secrets Elon Musk has revealed Wow! Welcome to Tesla Car World! Undeniably, despite production delays leading to limited availability, the Tesla Semi has truly sparked a revolution in the long-haul transportation industry with its remarkable performance. What we mean is that it has undoubtedly changed the way many perceive Class 8 trucks. More precisely, this is the first time in the world that an electric semi-truck can go head-to-head -head with diesel trucks, something no electric truck has ever achieved before. To deliver performance metrics that surpass any other electric truck, the semi is equipped with an 850 kilowatt-hour battery pack, consuming only 1.7 kilowatt-hours per mile, and has been officially verified to achieve a 500-mile range through real-world testing. However, Tesla isn't stopping there. The next version of the Semi or Semi Gen 2 will feature 4680 battery cells instead of the current 2170 cells and will be manufactured at a new facility. For us, this is very amazing. Why? The 4680 battery technology not only offers five times the energy capacity, but also six times the power output, enabling Semi trucks to achieve even longer ranges without needing to add excessive battery cells within a single pack. This is particularly crucial for electric trucks, as a lighter weight means they can carry more cargo. Elon Musk once emphasized, if, if you're a transport company, you don't use an electric, the Tesla Electric Semi, you're just losing money. Why would you do that? <laughs> do you not like money? <laughs> okay. Uh, but if you do like money, then I recommend using the Tesla Semi. This statement is not an exaggeration. It's an undeniable fact. Businesses are always looking to cut fuel costs, reduce maintenance expenses, and maximize profits. According to Tesla, charging costs are only half of what diesel refueling costs, allowing truck owners to save up to $150,000 within the first three years of operation. Yeah, this is really a significant amount of savings. Not only that, but with over-the-air software updates and fewer components requiring maintenance, the Tesla Semi helps businesses minimize downtime for repairs and maximize actual road time. The numbers don't lie. Major customers like PepsiCo, DHL, and Saya have tested the Tesla Semi and confirmed that its energy consumption is incredibly efficient, just as Tesla promised. With an operating cost of approximately 30 cents per mile, a 6.5-mile trip costs only about $3.30, whereas a traditional diesel truck would require at least one gallon of fuel, which costs around $3.66 per gallon, making diesel operations significantly more expensive. In reality, the Tesla Semi is not cheap at all. Some reports suggest that the 500-mile version could cost up to $250,000. While Elon Musk has not confirmed this figure, it is entirely plausible, especially considering that PepsiCo is said to have used a $4.5 million subsidy to purchase just 18 Semis. However, this high price may become more reasonable when factoring in low operating costs and the potential for significant long-term savings. With the expansion of the new factory, Tesla is ambitiously aiming to accelerate semi-production at an astonishing pace. Producing one Tesla semi every five minutes may sound unbelievable, but given Tesla's technological capabilities, it is entirely possible. Elon Musk believes that once the factory reaches full capacity, Tesla could produce 50,000 trucks per year, equivalent to more than 135 per day, over five per hour or roughly one truck every 10 to 15 minutes if the factory operates 24-7.
and if Tesla continues optimizing its manufacturing processes in the coming years, the goal of one semi every five minutes is not far-fetched. Additionally, rumors suggest that this factory will not only focus on the Tesla semi, but also house a secret project. Some sources, including Henrik Zane, a longtime observer of Giga Nevada and the progress of Tesla's new semi-production facility, have revealed the possibility that Tesla is developing an entirely new vehicle that will be produced alongside the semi once the factory is completed. He speculates that it could be the Robovan, a 20-seater autonomous vehicle. There are also suspicions about an 8-seater vehicle that Elon Musk mentioned late last year. If true, this vehicle might resemble the Ford e-Transit cargo van, but could cater to large families rather than just commercial purposes. What do you think about this? Regarding the Tesla Semi, Elon Musk has repeatedly emphasized that mass production will commence as soon as the new factory is completed. This will allow the electric truck to reach more customers beyond the limited distribution to a few large corporations, as is currently the case. In the recent Q4 earnings call, Elon Musk also hinted that the new Semi model would feature a groundbreaking innovation, offering unprecedented economic benefits to owners, something no other electric truck on the market can match. Specifically, Musk acknowledged that the Tesla Semi would provide superior advantages when equipped with full self-driving technology, a feature expected to be available in the near future, especially as Tesla ramps up large-scale production. If integrated, this would be a game-changer for the long-haul trucking industry. Full self-driving significantly reduces the strain of continuous driving, particularly on long trips, although drivers would still need to intervene when necessary. This not only allows them to rest, but also helps maintain their health and alertness, reducing the risk of fatigue-related accidents. One of the main reasons for the ongoing truck driver shortage is the harsh working conditions. Drivers often lack sufficient rest on long journeys, and the constant noise from traditional engines can negatively impact their health, leading many to leave the profession. In reality, the rising number of fatigue-related accidents caused by drowsy drivers highlights just how challenging this job is. Elon Musk himself has emphasized the truck driver shortage in the U.S., calling it one of the biggest constraints on the transportation industry. He has expressed deep respect for truck drivers, acknowledging that the job is not only demanding, but also becoming less appealing to new workers. During the Q4 earnings call, Tesla executives openly admitted that more drivers are leaving the industry than new ones are joining, which could pose serious challenges to supply chains in the future. Therefore, with large-scale production of the Tesla Semi combined with full self-driving, the trucking industry is poised to enter a new era. Drivers will no longer have to endure the stress of continuous long-haul driving, significantly reducing fatigue and improving working conditions. This is not only a major breakthrough for electric trucks, but also a potential solution to the labor shortage in the transportation sector. Of course, FSD alone is not the sole factor ensuring the safety of a Class 8 electric truck. To optimize the Tesla Semi's safety, engineers have continuously tested the big rig in various conditions especially in icy and freezing environments. While the Tesla Semi has demonstrated reliability in different operational scenarios and delivered impressive performance, the reality is that it still faces challenges when operating in extreme cold and heavy snow. For all electric vehicles, low temperatures significantly impact the performance of lithium-ion batteries, reducing range, extending charging times, and increasing energy consumption due to cabin heating and battery warming. While electric motors remain stable, the drivetrain and cooling systems can be affected if not optimized for harsh environments. Additionally, the truck's heavy weight improves traction, but can also make navigating icy roads more difficult if traction control systems are not precisely tuned. This is why most electric trucks struggle with operating on snowy and icy roads. Tesla Semi has actually undergone extensive testing over the past five years. A prototype was spotted returning from winter testing in Alaska just before Tesla began mass production. At the time, Tesla announced that it was preparing for several weeks of winter trials to evaluate the truck's performance in cold weather and low traction terrain. The company was eager to share findings from these tests, highlighting the superior advantages of electric motors and advanced traction control, capabilities that no diesel powertrain can match. However, Tesla has not stopped its winter testing for the Semi. Just last week, a Tesla Semi was spotted in Alaska, 
seemingly undergoing cold weather trials. Captured images show the truck's cabin almost entirely covered in snow, indicating that it has been tested under extreme conditions. In another video, a Tesla Semi with a trailer was seen maneuvering through the snowy terrain, appearing to operate smoothly. If you take a closer look at this Semi, you'll notice that its roof is shorter compared to previous Semi models we've seen. At first glance, this might lead to the assumption that it is the standard range 300-mile variant. However, according to Dan Priestley, who commented under the post, the roof height variance is independent of range variance. The one in the video is a long-range semi, just with a shorter roof meant for lower-profile trailers like flatbeds, drop decks, tankers, etc. Better aero for those setups. This confirms that Tesla is not only refining the semi's winter performance, but also optimizing its design for different trailer configurations to improve aerodynamics. For those who remain skeptical about the Tesla Semi, the most important question has always been, can this truck truly perform well in extreme conditions? More specifically, its ability to operate in the freezing cold of Alaska serves as the ultimate test to prove its capabilities. Of course, we don't yet know the exact results of Tesla's Alaska testing. Only Tesla has that data. Let's be realistic. No company would openly share unfavorable results just to invite criticism, right? But that doesn't mean we should assume the Tesla Semi will fail. The reality is that any electric vehicle operating in extreme environments like Alaska will face unique challenges, from faster battery depletion and increased drivetrain stress to unpredictable variables related to cold weather endurance. What truly matters is that Tesla is proactively testing and refining the Semi to ensure that when it officially hits the market, it won't just be an electric truck. It will be a sustainable transportation solution capable of thriving even in the harshest conditions. With large-scale production capabilities from its new factory, Tesla plans to deliver a significant number of Semis to pre-order customers while expanding sales opportunities for new buyers by the end of this year. Most recently, Watt EV, a company specializing in electric truck services, signed an agreement to purchase 40 Tesla Semis. The first two have already been delivered and are currently operating at the ports of Long Beach and Los Angeles, marking a significant step toward electrifying logistics in the region. The remaining 38 units are expected to be delivered by Tesla before the end of next year. To support operations, Watt EV is also investing in Tesla's fourth-generation charging stations at its logistics hubs. Salim Yousafzadeh, CEO of Watt EV, emphasized, the Tesla Semi is currently the only truck on the market capable of achieving 500 miles on a single charge with exceptional energy efficiency and fast charging capabilities. This is especially crucial for our company, as Watt EV operates long-haul routes of up to 550 miles per day in California. With ambitious goals, Watt EV aims to deploy 12,000 heavy-duty electric trucks on California roads by 2030 and build 100 charging stations by 2035. The company has already taken strategic steps, ordering 50 Volvo VNR electric trucks in 2022, followed by an additional 14 Nikola Trebevs in 2023 for operations at the Long Beach port. Currently, Watt EV is on track to expand its fleet to 180 electric trucks by the end of this year. However, the key factor for Tesla Semi's true market breakthrough is production capacity. At present, all Semi models are still assembled on a limited production line at Gigafactory Nevada. But Tesla is not stopping there. It is constructing an entirely new factory dedicated to producing its electric trucks. Once operational by the end of 2025, Tesla aims to reach an annual production capacity of 50,000 semis, transforming it from an experimental product into a true revolution in long-haul trucking. While awaiting the new factory, semi-production is already ramping up significantly. Aerial images frequently shared online show bustling manufacturing activity, signaling a promising future for Tesla's most powerful electric truck to date. The question is no longer whether the Tesla Semi can compete with diesel trucks, but how soon it will replace them entirely. Some people still mistakenly believe that the Tesla Semi is just an ordinary electric truck, incapable of competing with diesel trucks. However, the production delays are not a sign of failure, but rather a calculated strategy. Tesla needed time to gather real-world data from drivers to ensure that when the Semi enters mass production, it will not just be another electric truck, it will be a true revolution in the transportation industry. If you think the Tesla Semi has no advantage over diesel trucks or other electric models, that would be a huge mistake. Let the numbers speak for themselves because in business, 
numbers are what truly matter. Lower operating costs, reduced maintenance, and superior economic benefits are the reasons why the Tesla Semi is not just the future of transportation, but also the smartest investment for any business. In short, the Tesla Semi is more than just an electric truck. It is a major leap forward in the heavy-duty transport industry, offering outstanding economic, technological, and environmental benefits. First and foremost, cost savings are the most crucial factor that makes the Tesla Semi a worthwhile investment. While its initial price may be higher than that of a diesel truck, its significantly lower operating costs allow businesses to save hundreds of thousands of dollars per year thanks to superior energy efficiency and minimal maintenance expenses. This is an undeniable advantage for transportation companies, where every mile directly impacts profitability. Secondly, the impressive range of the Tesla Semi makes it a reliable choice for long-haul routes. With the ability to travel up to 500 miles on a full charge and real-world demonstrations proving it can cover over 1,000 miles per day with just two charges, the Semi effectively meets the demands of continuous freight transportation. This not only helps businesses optimize operating time, but also alleviates concerns about charging, one of the biggest hurdles for electric vehicles in the past. Thirdly, the superior driving experience is a significant advantage of the Tesla Semi. Thanks to its powerful tri-motor system, the truck can accelerate quickly even when carrying heavy loads, making it easier to navigate challenging roads. Moreover, advanced safety technologies such as anti-rollover protection provide drivers with greater confidence behind the wheel. This not only reduces the risk of accidents, but also improves working conditions for truck drivers, an essential factor in the transportation industry. Additionally, Fast charging time is another major advantage of the Tesla Semi. Taking only about 40 minutes to fully recharge minimizes downtime and aligns with driver rest regulations. This is a significant improvement over previous electric truck models, allowing the Tesla Semi to compete effectively with traditional diesel trucks in terms of operational efficiency. Beyond its economic and technological benefits, the Tesla Semi also plays a crucial role in environmental protection. With the heavy-duty transportation sector accounting for a significant portion of global emissions, replacing diesel trucks with electric alternatives like the Tesla Semi can substantially reduce CO2 emissions, contributing to a more sustainable transportation system. This shift is inevitable as nations and businesses increasingly prioritize eco-friendly transportation solutions. Finally, the Tesla Semi is shaping the future of the trucking industry with large-scale production plans and continuous innovation. With a target of producing 50,000 units annually by 2026, Tesla is not only cementing its leadership in the electric truck market, but also setting a new standard for the industry. The ongoing advancements in electric vehicle technology, along with improvements in battery efficiency and charging infrastructure, will further strengthen the Tesla Semi's competitive edge in the years to come. When do you think Tesla Semi will be able to completely replace diesel trucks in the transportation industry? What impresses you most about Tesla Semi? Low operating costs, advanced technology, or environmental benefits?